In this video, we will talk about Google Docking and other search engines that are essential for OS Int. Search engines are online tools that enable users to access information from the internet. They play a crucial role in open source intelligence by facilitating efficient and effective information retrieval from publicly available resources. Search engines empower OS Int practitioners with rapid access to diverse information enhancing the process of gathering insights from publicly accessible resources. Some of the benefits of using search engines in OS Int are listed. They can be used for cross-referencing and comparing information from multiple sources to validate facts and patterns. They can be used for monitoring. We can use them to continuously track keywords, topic, or individuals for ongoing awareness. They can be used to extract hidden information, normal detection, and also for supporting the CN. Now let's see what is Google Docs. Google hacking or docking utilizes Google advanced search engine features, which allow you to pick up a custom content. You can, for instance, pick out results from a certain domain name using the site filter, or you can use different filters that are listed. The Google Hacking Database is an index of search queries used to find publicly accessible information intended for pen testers and security researchers. You can go to the website and you can get all type of Google Docs, including the Docs for vulnerability research and finding the vulnerable websites. In addition to Google Docs, Google also has a feature called Google Advanced Search. It is a set of specialized search features and filters that allow users to refine their research queries to find more precise and specific results. It offers a range of tools beyond the basic search bar, enabling users to tailor their searches based on various criteria. Now let's see the demonstration. Normally in any search engines, we search for any term. For example, let's search for CEH on Google and we get a bunch of information. We get information from different domains including the official domain and some other domains as well. Now let's assume that we want to get information about CEH from the official website only. Now we can use the filter site and tell it that we want the information from ecconsole.org only. Now search it and you can see that we only get the results from the same official domain. Now let's suppose that we want to get information about CH what people are discussing on Reddit. So use the filter site reddit.com and we get the Reddit board links. Similarly, we can also search for the PDF documents with the name of CH, just use the filter file type PDF and see that we have the PDF documents now, including the CH brochures, exam blueprints, etc. Now, let's suppose that we want to find all login pages in a single domain. We can use the query login and specify the domain. And you can see that for EC console, we have found some login pages for the official website, for the code red and iLabs, etc. We can also enumerate subdomains of a domain by using the filter dash www and we get a bunch of subdomains. Google Docking can also be used for vulnerability research. For example, you can use the doc that is shown here to search for all SQL injection vulnerable websites having .pk in their domain. You can query Google Hacking Database to query all type of Google Docs. For example, let's just use the second doc which looks for password.txt files. And you can see that we get a bunch of URLs. 
you can click on any one and can see that there is a pass.txt file with some data in it. Now let's see Google Advanced Search. Once you query on a Google, look at the results. You can filter these results with types such as images, videos, etc. You can click on the gear icon on the top right corner and go to the advanced search. Here you can specify some specific parameters for advanced search. For example, we can specify that we want the exact phrase. We can specify the language and domain as well. And we get our results. Now let's see some other search engines. The other major search engine is Bing, whereas the Yandex is a Russian search engine, whereas Bedu is a Chinese search engine. And if you are looking to preserve your privacy, you can use DuckDuckGo. These search engines help us to look at the information from different angles and can often reveal hidden information that is not available on Google. For example, we can search for CS certification on Bing. And we will get the results that were not visible in Google, including some courses from Simply iLearn and Udemy as well. You can go to DuckDuckGo and search for anything. Similarly, you can make use of Yandex and Bedu. These search engines are specifically useful when you are looking for information on Chinese and Russian websites. So in this manner, we can use search engines for our advantage on OS 8 and gather basic information about the target.